And you're welcome. Since it's a Thursday, well, of course, you know what we do here. It's called Artsy Thursdays for a reason. And today for Arts Display, we have Akiemi Olakunle. He joins us to talk about his expressions. He's a native of Ocean State and he's a visual artist. Secret about him is that he's also a musician as well. He plays juju music, but we'll talk about his art today. He's a graduate of the Yaba College of Technology and also majored in painting. Good to have you here, Kunle. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Fantastic. First off, we've got just one of your art pieces here, which we'll be talking about in a minute. But we've also got plenty of your pictures, which you sent in from earlier. But first, I always like to ask artists, I'm very excited about expressions, but I always like to ask people, well, to give us a theme or define their art or their form or the theme of their art in maybe one or few words. So how would you define your kind of art? Okay, uh, thank you very much. Actually, I love... Um, so uh, the, the way I do my artworks uh, in mixed media, I use uh, different medium mm -hmm. to, to express myself. Mm -hmm. So um, I did uh, my artworks in uh, different mediums and... Uh, so it's I, not just painting, it's painting, maybe a bit of structure to it, a bit exactly. of it's not this just and that. Painting. I have to add different um, materials elements. together. I mean, exactly, thank you. Wow. Different elements together to, to, to bring out what I feel like, as in what my spirit, because I love uh, uh, quiet time. Every yeah. day I normally give myself like maybe 10, 20 minutes quiet time to mm. think. Nice. I do that too every single morning. I come exactly. here so early and I like to be the only person in the place. <laughs> Let's go to your artwork now. I'm going to raise this on the couch and I'm going to tell you what I think about your artwork. Okay. No, don't worry. It's not jam. But <laughs> when I first saw this, along with some of the other uh, ones that, we, that you sent in, I thought, this person loves music. And hey, what did I know? Before I knew it, we found out that you're also a juju musician. Am I correct? Oh, yes, yes. So, gospel. am I gospel juju musician? So, am I correct if I say that this is inspired by some kind of music element? Am I correct? Um, somehow. Oh, then I'm but... wrong. Is this somehow? Because I was hoping out. Because I saw the strings on there, and I thought that looks like a guitar string or something. Strings and music go together. So I thought so. But let me let you define this for us. What is this called, and what uh, exactly inspired it? All right, that is called time. Oh, time. Time. The connection between the sky, the heaven and the earth. Oh. It's time. And all the black um, rubbers there stands for human, human being. So okay. you need to connect yourself with time. Mm. So you won't waste your time. Mm. So anything you are doing that is not useful for you and it's not useful for others, that, is, that means you are wasting your time. Mm. So when you connect yourself with the time, the Yobaya did say that uh, be ojobayi, Bye bye, I'm on bye ye Let me try, let me try, let me try. Yeah, somebody should. Okay. <laughs> Does it mean, yes, they want me to interpret it without actually being told. Did you just say the way time goes is how it comes back? Exactly. Karma. Exactly. So it goes and comes. Exactly. Hey, Mr. Sheggs, can I get a round of applause for my interpretation at least? Come on, somebody. <laughs> Thank you, Titi. <laughs> so, you're inspired by more than the ordinary, more than the visual. You're inspired by how you feel. Exactly. And your heritage as well. You just made a Yoruba proverb is also one of the things that inspires your paintings as well. Yes. I like the fact that this is oil. Is that oil? It's not oil, it's acrylic. Acrylic. And that is what now? They're both acrylic. They're both acrylic. So, but this I, is more mosaic than that. Exactly. I texturize my ground here yeah, and I leave this. This ground means that it serves as uh, the, the ground. That's the earth. Mm. So that's the sky. Oh, earth and sky. Exactly. And then the connection. Exactly. Now I get it. Mm -hmm. I still can't remove the musical element in any case. But that's, that's fantastic. So uh, we're going to be showing a few other of your paintings on the screen here so viewers at home could see um, other expressions. So are your paintings or expressions all connected? Do you have like what we're looking at on the screen now? Um, we can see this beautiful um, group of people. Oh, and there's another one again, the village setting. What connects most of your artwork? Is it the people? Is it the form? Is it what? Well, that is beautiful. You see, that, that one you're seeing uh, on the screen right now, that, that one that just yeah. is uh, opportunity. Opportunity. Yes. The one with the beautiful titled, lady. Yes, I titled Opportunity. Mm -hmm. So uh, uh, you see that, that that beautiful lady was wearing, uh, is just wearing uh, a costume. That's carnival costume. Yeah, carnival. Co yeah, exactly. exactly. And that carnival costume can only be worn uh, on the uh, festive period. Period. That's the December mm -hmm. carnival. Yeah. And when you miss that time, you, you can't. You have to wait. Mm -hmm. So when you have the opportunity, grab Take it. Take it. 
So that leads to time. Ah, so is that the element then? Is time the element that, you know, themes your work? Could yeah, you say that? Yes. Okay, very interesting. Time, opportunity. Time and opportunity. opportunity. All right, fantastic. Um, so your artwork, they appeal to everybody or people who are more uh, culturally inclined, would you say? Who does it appeal to? Who do you find that embraces your kind of um, painting more? Is it uh, people who are uh, rooted in Nigerian culture or foreigners? Well, I'll say both. Okay. I'll say both because what I'm talking about is not just Mm. In Nigeria. It doesn't just pertain to Nigeria. It's, it's exactly. All right, fantastic. Your art pieces, for instance, this. If I wanted to have this in my place, in my home, what would it cost me? <laughs> Everybody laughs when I, ask them, when I ask them that question. Why? But I, 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 I just like to know because um, artworks are something that you can't put a price on, quite frankly. Exactly. It depends how emotionally invested you are as the artist or the person who's consuming it visually mm -hmm. how much i'd want to pay could be a whole lot more than you even is estimated so I, I i understand when artists don't want to tell exactly how much they they, they want to sell uh, certain paintings are we looking forward to having an exhibition of any sort sometime soon of all your artworks like what we've just seen on television yes very soon by december in december yeah okay and it was an exhibition right. my wife my wife too she's, she's oh, your wife is an artist as well yes wow your artist. house must be very colorful <laughs> so in December, you guys are going to have a, yeah. an exhibition together, exhibition both of together. you. Yeah. Uh, you should have brought her on the show. would have loved to have her on. What's going to be the theme of the artwork since it's you and Although you? Although our own work, she's working on Candy Crush. Candy Crush? It's still time. It's still time. Because mm. when you're supposed to be doing uh, some other things, mm -hmm. you'll be playing Candy Crush, you're wasting your time. Yeah. So she has a series <laughs> of Candy Crush. So she's a Candy Crush sports. enthusiast. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is very interesting. So. Now, I've never met an artist who was married to another artist, and I'm wondering what your kids would be like. Is it, is, are you bringing up a, an artsy home? I'm sure that you'd encourage art, yeah. um, unlike my parents who, I don't hold, them against, hold anything against them, but I wish they let me express my artistic um, side more than the other sides of me. But what's your home like as an artist married to another artist? Well, I would just leave my kids to, so, I didn't, to decide. Right? Mm -hmm. so, but normally they have to pick yeah. from us. Okay. One or two will pick that line. Okay. That oh. line. Oh, that's very interesting. Yeah, that's very interesting. Well, Mr. Kunli, thank you very much for coming to display and show us your beautiful artworks. It's very, very interesting to have you here. And we're looking forward to that joint exhibition between you and your wife sometime in December. Please let us know. Make sure that we're invited so we can come and cover it and see the beautiful pieces that you guys would be uh, displaying then. And of course, maybe you should have on display a band so we could hear some of your gospel music. Yes, I have to. Integrate. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> thank you very much, Kunle. Thank you, well, sir. Thank you very much for watching Art Display here. I just want to show this one more time because I think it's a beautiful art piece. This is by our artist here, Al Kunle, in the studio. And it is Time. 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 It's called Time. What now? Time. Yes. Time. Well, so thank you very much, everybody. Oh.